This is what you are. This is where, where you are. This, this is the so be it, right? These were promises, and many people have walked in some of them or in them to a degree, but not living in them. Now, living in them, there's two aspects or two degrees or whatever you want to say it, of living in them. One is living in them. For instance, many people didn't know that uh, by his stripes you were healed and that you could be healed if you were sick before you heard that you could be healed. That you, were, you didn't know that, so you were not embracing, you were not experiencing, is a better way to say it, you weren't experiencing the promise of by his stripes you were healed. Now, you might have been experiencing your sins were forgiven while he was on the cross, but you didn't experience by his stripes you were healed. Why? Because you didn't know you were in him and didn't know that he had borne that for you. And so there's one level. As soon as you find that out, you go, wow, I can be healed. And so then you get healed. And whenever you get sick, you come for prayer or you come to be ministered to and you get healed. That's one level. The, other le- the next level is that you find out that by his stripes you were healed, and that's constant and ongoing, so you can get healed, and then from then on, stay healed. And you can live healed. See, that's the so be it. So be healed. In other words, you're be. You're in the state of being at all times of healed. See, when you do that, that's called divine health. That, and that's a different level of walking. It's all the same thing. It's still you experiencing the benefits of by his stripes you were healed. The difference is you find out that not only can you get healed, but you can live healed. Amen? And living healed is living in health. So that is a promise that, it, that is supposed to be, that, well, matter of fact, it's already yes, and he expects it to so be it. But you have to decide so be it. Amen? In other words, you can't be waiting for the promise. You can't be waiting for him to say yes. You are, you, he's already said yes, so now you just begin thanking him for the yes and just start being. Amen? This is how you live. 